as we've talked about a couple of times on the podcast, the Atlanta Fed, they publish a GDP now metric that shows GDP is expected to maybe even contract to bomb. <laughs> in, yeah, bomb in the middle half of the year. So, so definitely keep an eye on that one. This, yeah, this is Q1 GDP. It would definitely capture any business hesitation preceding the tariffs. I do you think, you know, even, we've said it many times, but even late last year, we were starting to see just, just a general you know, weakening a little bit of the economy, slowdown of the economy, you know, hiring was freezing up a little bit. Just again, a big number for the economy, see how we're doing. Um, but this is completely sans tariffs. No, no impact there quite yet. We'll, we'll get that number beginning in July for the Q2. For Q2. Yep. Right. There's further consumer spending metrics on Wednesday. And then the big one that I would really keep an eye on can be PCE. Probably going to see a disinflationary number there. It's expected in at 0.1%. That's just kind of in line with the how CPI and PPI came out this month. Uh, both of those were came in under soft on the inflation. But got to keep in mind, this is all... Um, before or, or just beginning to price in the tariffs. Um, and, and I know we'll talk about tariffs in, with KJ here in a few minutes, but the inflation from the tariffs is going to, to bleed in the economy pretty slowly, in my opinion, um, and, and it'd be relatively sticky. 